Um, we all know that uh, the average person that walks into our office and looking for care for lung cancer is over the age of 70. But when we look at clinical trial data, uh, those patients are not over age 70. They represent a minority where in truth they're the majority and that's always been an issue. The second thing is um, we know that many patients with uh, advanced non-small cell lung cancer uh, over the age of 70 are simply not treated. Uh, there was a report uh, in the Journal of Clinical Oncology a few months ago uh, and again, this report was from uh, SEER data from 1997 to 2002. But in that report, only a quarter of the patients over age 70 were being treated with chemotherapy. And of that quarter that were getting chemotherapy, two-thirds of them were only getting one chemotherapy agent. So the standard of care, at least back then, was nothing. Uh, and then when chemotherapy was to be used, uh, people were using one drug. And this was SEER data, this wasn't clinical trial data, this is what people were actually doing. So in this trial from a French cooperative group, they randomized fit uh, older adults age 70 and above, only age 70 and above were on this trial, to receive one chemotherapeutic agent or two. And uh, the results were actually pretty dramatic that for uh, the patients that received the two drugs, they had a longer, not just pro progression-free survivor, survival, but also uh, overall survival by a matter of four months.